Takmina was founded at the base of one of Japan's largest silver mines. When I first visited Takmina Corporation Japan, I didn't realize how large it was. We have a huge factory, probably a total combined of nearly a million square feet of production. Each of our smooth flow pumps is built to spec. Customers going with the smooth flow solution, it's not something that's coming straight off the shelf. Because we completely control the manufacturing process of our pumps, we can make them out of anything. PVC, Hastelloy, stainless steel, acrylic, PVDF, you name it. Almost any material so we can service any kind of chemical compatibility requirement using the wet end materials of, of choice. Pumps that can easily handle the various chemicals requirements of water treatment or chemical processes have a lot of pulsation to them, which can be a problem when you're doing precision mixing. You need to make sure everything is exact. We came up with a design that gave the pulsation-free pump with no additional hardware needed on the system itself. So we developed a unique pump uh, with a unique engineering. We make a pump uh, under the 15 microliter per minute to up to 150 liter per minute. As we receive raw materials into our manufacturing facility, they're processed. For example, they might be cut into stock rounds for our turning processes. They go through the machining process and then they're completely checked. So it's very, very important that these parts and pieces are machined to exacting tolerances. Starting from a raw casting, it's important to have a solid casting. As a matter of fact, our casting specification is the same type of material that's used in machine tools. After the parts are, are CNC machined, in some cases they need to have fittings welded onto them and other components that would made up so that a pump can be disassembled quickly and easily and of course reassembled. After the parts are machined, welded, have gone through secondary machining processes such as polish, machine polish or electro polishing for example, uh, they're going to take one of two paths. They're either going to go into stock for future pump builds, uh, more common pumps that we ship, or they're going to go right on to assembly where all of the parts, components, bolts, and hardware are added to that cart and then it goes to a single person who manages the entire assembly process. The job jacket travels with the pump and the technician will know the specification of that pump when they read that job jacket. From there, they can confirm that all the parts that are on that assembly cart are correct before the assembly process starts. Most of our pumps are assembled on our plant floor. Some of our very high grade pumps are assembled in a clean room to ensure that there's no contamination in the gearbox or the hydraulic side of the gearbox. Everything starts with the shell, which is essentially the casting. The technician will begin to add the internal components like the drive shuttle, the, the, the cam, the push rods for the diaphragms, any oil seals and things that go in the inside of the pump. Before you paint it, all oils have to be removed. They're cleaned with a solvent, and then that solvent is neutralized before they go into the paint process. We typically paint our pumps our flagship Takmina Yellow, but we can paint a pump any color. This is where they add the pump heads, the manifolds, and all of the external parts of the pump. The final drive is installed on the pump. This is the last step before it goes off to test. In Japan, we use several different types of motors, non-explosion proof, explosion proof, but in most cases, we purchase our motors from Motion that go on our pumps for U.S. applications. We've gone on site with uh, quite a few Motion uh, field reps. It's a wonderful experience because these people have typically been with Motion Industries, maybe even in some cases for decades. They're extremely knowledgeable about their customers' processes and facilities. Therefore, they can deliver beyond what most people or other companies can deliver. Yeah, Motion and the Takamina has the same philosophy. Uh, to help the customer side and then to provide a solution to the customer.